Welcome back, everybody. I told you I wouldn't stay away too long. So I'm going to do this one right after the first and second. I explored the whole facility unseen. I sensed a demon under the factory. The succubus. An ancient one. Oh, look. They look like little slurms. The source of the slurm worms. Ingredient. That's what they use to control us. Welcome, visitors, to the Virility Factory. Virility's Herpa secret derp. ingredient is what makes Virility the number one soft drink in the world. And best of all, it has been scientifically proven to improve weight loss by 21% and enhance sexual performance by 63%. If How do people daily. actually fall for this crap? If you're told something's true often enough, you tend to believe it. They told me I was crazy for seeing demons. Yeah. They tried telling me I was a basket case, too. They wanted to put me on drugs. Said it would make me better. They lied. They just wanted to keep me weak. Docile. How did you figure it all out? Virgil pulled me out of the nightmare. You? When the people you're supposed to trust most turn out to be... Dumb. Your eyes really do open up to evil everywhere. I took a stand, fought back, killed, no matter the consequences. So I chose my path and I lived by it. I don't think that's fighting or and killing all that anger, anger <laughs> violence, and death. You have to dig deep, dig into your own heart, to see if you are still sane, or if you can still call yourself human. I just knew in my heart I wasn't crazy. A little brutal. Secret ingredient of virility. It's slurm. It could be people too. Could just be soiling green. I heard that sounds pretty good. He's straight on a tap, huh? The succubus is hidden deep inside the factory, but there is no physical way to reach it from our world. Only from Limbo. There's a rift inside. Rest assured that it has been deemed both safe and beneficial by our trustworthy and ethical scientists. Of course. Of course. Oh, I guess I better start paying attention, huh? <laughs> so, everybody, welcome back to, uh, well, more Dante. This way, I think. You said you'd been here before. <laughs> yes, but it was during an out-of-body experience years ago. Flying around in spirit form. Oh, yeah, in no limbo. Weapon. Virgil says it could be an effective intelligence gathering tool, but I can't do it at will. So, how did you do it before? It was triggered by extreme psychosomatic trauma. The nightmares. What are the nightmares? It's in the past now. This doesn't look overall very safe. Just freaking electricity just sparking everywhere. But, but what's over there? Yeah, I'll, I'll be right back. <laughs> Assuming maybe you were supposed to go explore this later once we're going to Limbo. Because, I mean, with no weapon right now, it's... Yeah, didn't think so. Oh, well, had to check. Can't jump, can't boost, can't do anything. At least we look like Dante and not Dante. If you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, but seriously. Alrighty. We got the rift yet? Assuming we're gonna have to run out of this too. Not good to assume usually, but I've been pretty right so far, so. Let's just go with that. This is where they store the merchandise ready for export. It's funny. What is? I expected it to be bigger. A lot bigger. But then, I was just a child when I was here. And I was in limbo. What are you doing here? Escaping my nightmares. You came to limbo to escape your nightmares? Yes. <laughs> yeah, probably says a couple things about her. Nothing negative as far as I'm concerned. She's pretty awesome. Once you're in limbo, all you have to do is retrace your steps back to the mixing room. 
Should be easy enough. Maybe, but the demons may sense you once you're in limbo, so stay alert. And once I've reached the mixing room? You'll be able to descend deep down into the factory. And kill me a succubus. Sounds good. Can we find the rift? Seriously, this walking around sucks. Okay, it's here. Well, at least she got better about doing the uh, symbols. All right, see you on the other side. Yep, flying crap. Definitely limbo. Down here. Oh, good. You're right. It's a lot bigger here in Limbo. What next? Head back to the mixing room. I'll meet you there. Obesity, stupidity, drink virility. <laughs> Pretty much. It's just different ways of going about the same path. Poison. Yes, we get it. Or are these going to be multiple different paths that we can take to do different things. Like what's up here? You are up here. Hey, buddy. What took you so long? Ah. Oh, nice. We got the kick in. Ah, oh, couldn't get in time. All right, so we want to kind of go through, probably go to the different things around here. See, that's up there. What's that way though? Ah. Too many different places to go. Darn it, game. It's down there. Well, I'm gonna pretty much just choose a path and I think kind of go with it. Otherwise, this, this might get ridiculous. So I'm assuming we have like the, uh, the lost souls will be scattered about here and we should probably look around more for them, but that's just a pain in the ass. Uh, let's do that. Let's do that. Ah, oh, wrong button. There we go. Ooh, what do we have here? Oh, a fire knight, I'm assuming. Rather fight these guys, I bet you these guys. Oh, hell knight, my, my apologies. I bet hey, you these guys. Hey, you me to the mixing room? Are probably gonna die easier because, well, this thing does a ton of damage. Boom! Oops, wrong button. Oh, that's not good, probably.
some explodies. Really definitely like the axe. Which is, uh, should be no surprise to anybody that watches my Binding of Isaac, or I would say even to some extent my Civ videos, or just about any of my videos. I tend to like destruction and power. I feel it's a good way to do things. Oh, I couldn't even get through it that way, huh? Alright, how... So up in the left, maybe? Up in the right, maybe. Ah, up in the right. I like it. Really wish Nine Inch Nails did a uh, did the soundtrack for this game. The soundtrack's pretty good, but Nine Inch Nails soundtrack would be pretty awesome. Ooh. Okay, is there an easy way to get back? Yes, there is. Thank you, game. All right, well, we've picked up a decent amount of stuff so far. Not probably everything. I bet you we probably missed some uh, lost souls there, but overall, not too shabby. At least we're now on our way back. And hopefully no more stupid verticality puzzles. Stupidity, indeed. Da -da 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 -da. What the hell was that? Okay. Ah, damn it. Spoke too soon. Well, this one doesn't look as complex, but I'm assuming that there's probably something around the side. And I really need to stop saying I assume to any extent. It's... We get it. Oh! Kick in the face! Kick it again! Hello. Alright, uh, could we have gone that way? Possibly. That. What's up here? Oh, where we're supposed to go, so let's not do that quite yet. I'm really happy. I mean, uh, maybe I'm incorrect, or I just had the, a bad. Oh, hey, buddy. But the, uh, the cursing, the language, is not nearly as bad as I expected it to be. And although cursing is not a big deal in general, it just, I felt it really kind of demeaned the game a little bit. So it's really kind of cool that I seem to have been wrong. Ooh, that's, yeah, that's interesting. <laughs> um... What is this? Okay, so we still can't seemingly do anything with this. Which kind of sucks on multiple levels. But I do want to go over here and get this key. Nice, our first Argent key allows Dante to open the Argent doors. Very cool, very groovy, baby. And what is the best way to get through that? Uh, seems like a long shot, but let's try it. Oh, might be able to do it. This does take health from me, so. Oh, yeah, probably not the best way to do it. 
let's stop doing that because there's no reason to just continually take health damage. Uh, can't touch this. Advanced hip. Demon mode renders Dante immune to Hell Knight's Ground Inferno. Okay. Cool. That's actually really good to know. Oh, didn't even see him come out of the, uh... Fire. Oops. Okay, you guys need to get away from each other. sloppy there, but uh, for the first time fighting both of those, uh, I'll take it. Could be worse. Uh. Okay. Oh, come on. Really? Okay, maybe we need to be higher. Uh, bloody heck. Oh, screw it. I tried. Not very hard, but I also want to keep this LP going in uh, a forward momentum. Like I said, we're not going to be going for 100% completion. Definitely a big fight. <laughs> uh, regular guys. Oh, where was my dodge? It was not there. Timing to show up, buddy. Well, not for you, but for me. Whee! Oh, friendly 